This video is uh, the second video in the series about True Fuel. This is the True, F True Fuel website. What we're talking is a 50 to 1. And uh, looking at their site, what it is is an engineered fuel. They have here why to use uh, the true fuel and it's ready to use is a convenience plus it lasts two years opened and five years unopened so this fuel will go bad it will not last forever but they state that right at the beginning so reading down farther they're showing the equipment and the types of things that it doesn't have. Reading over here, ready to use, 92 plus octane, free from harmful octane rating, we'll talk about a little later. Uh, free harmful uh, ethanol and, and all this stuff. Uh, long shelf life, again, five years to unopened, consistent formula throughout the year. Basically, it's a, uh, it's a canned fuel. It costs a lot of money as compared to regular gasoline but uh, it is convenient and it hasn't uh, failed on me but I only buy as much as I need to go through the year you know I always have one can for my neighbor to use and then uh, when he's done with that I'll go out and buy another one and I do the same thing up at the farm all right now I want to discuss gasoline phasing here from PetroClear P-E-T-R-O clear uh, understanding the dangers of separation so I went to this site here to uh, take a look and I suggest you you watch it uh, it's probably an evil company you know maybe they have things in the big box store things like that which is ridiculous it's a company that deals with uh, petroleum and you can take a look at this hit the button I think it goes to uh, YouTube and will tell you all about it oh, I can hear it on my headset okay. so anyway you can go uh, look up this site because that's where I uh, went to and what happens with uh, phasing is they uh, basically put ethanol in the uh, fuel. Okay, and it will uh, make a layer because it bonds with water. Water is heavier than fuel. Uh, from memory reading books, uh, diesel like jet fuel weighs 6.6 .6 pounds, I think it is, per uh, gallon and water is 8.333 so water's heavier you know it's uh, vinegar and oil they separate right things like that this isn't super hard chemistry but they decided to use ethanol to clean to uh also uh yeah basically to clean i preferred mtbe when we could do it but the uh government or whoever restricted the use of that and so now we get uh, ethanol from corn okay good morning everybody this is the uh an empty can of true fuel right here as i'm reading scanning through i don't see where it talks about uh how long it lasts but it's, uh, you can store it for, I guess, five years. You open it. And, uh, if you also synthetic oil, 51 mixture. This is the empty can. My neighbor said this wasn't running right. This is a, uh, 52, uh, excuse me, I'm dyslexic on you 
FS250R, and he told me this chainsaw, this is one of mine that I brought for him to use. It hasn't been used very much, but uh, it wouldn't start. And my guess is always first fuel, because I don't recall when he used this last. So let me come over here. Set this down. Open the tank. Okay. Now, you can't smell. <laughs> you're obviously you're on video, but I can. And I can tell this fuel isn't good. Okay, I don't know if you can see in there well. It looks brownish not red and it definitely doesn't smell good but I'm gonna pour this out so let me get configured so I can do that okay I'm only gonna get one chance at this this is a steel MS 250 and I'm gonna pour out what I'm calling bad gas from motor and let's see what color it is. Is that pink? I don't think so. When I fill it back up with true fuel, you didn't hear that. We will know, but that's going to be at the next video because, yeah, I don't know. You look at this fuel right here, it is not red. My guess is it has synthetic steel fuel in it. I don't know how old it is, I will dispose of this correctly. Or set myself on fire. But anyway, that's going to be all for this video. And I need to let the saw air out. Okay, I'm going to go set it in the corner and let it air out. Thanks for watching the second video. The second one will be a third in not too long.